What's up lads? Today we're going to be going over the full journey to rebind your keys in rematch. So firstly, what you're going to want to do is click the link in the description that will take you to a program called Auto Hotkey. And it's going to look something like this. Uh, us older dudes in the community may know it from games such as uh, RuneScape or just like Cookie Clicker. Because uh, you can use it to make auto clickers, obviously, auto hotkey. Um, you, can make, you, a little bit. you can make like any custom script you want. Now you're going to hit download and probably this one is the, it's the most up-to-date version, at least buggy. Uh, once you've done that, you, you've installed it. You're now going to want to go to anywhere on your desktop or wherever. You're going to new folder and just call, call it remaps or remap. doesn't really matter. So once you open that up, uh, you're then going to want to create a new uh, text folder. Call that something like anything anything you want literally remap uh, and then you want to put a little thing called dot ahk uh, that is the folder the file extension not folder for uh, auto hotkey which has not worked but uh, there that's not in all there so now we're going to right click open with open with notepad there you go so it saved it as a, a thing yeah, that's fine um, but then you're going to want to copy the thing in my description the little script um and that is like that and then i oh, you know you'll, you'll be able to remove the dot txt extension yeah, that's that's fine you you know how to do that in your your files uh model file file type or whatever so let's just quickly go over what these all are so left control is currently the dribble stance uh which doesn't feel very comfortable um for me personally so what i've done is i've bound that to my mouse key button so the side of your mouse what I'm using the second mouse button for is lob passes. Then we've got this funky little SC12, colon, colon, space. So we've actually got three versions of space. Uh, this is because I was personally um, experimenting on which one I liked. I'm probably going to get rid of the caps lock, but I'm leaving it in there for now. This is your tackle or dive button. Um, so you can change that to whatever you like. Uh, and then space to V. So V currently is your pushable mechanic. Personally, I like it on space just because it's... It's a very large button, so it's, it's good to have it on something that's quite important. And yeah, you can change these to whatever you like. I'll also leave a link in the description for the like the mappings, so you can see like X button one, what what that is, what that means, um, and it'll just you can change it to whatever you like. This has been a very very short little tutorial for you all. I hope this helps. Um, and then in game. You can kind of see some of my clips if you click on any of the videos on my channel. You'll see me playing games and it's just kind of, it works. It, it works nicely. Um, yeah, short little video. Thank you very much. Much love to you. Mwah. See you later, guys.